Well, it's a little early for bar hopping this morning, isn't it? Well, since you disappeared on me last night, I never got my good morning kiss. Well, you know what? That just happens to be our special this morning. If you don't quit, I'm gonna drop every one of these cans on the floor. Hmm. How are we supposed to go to the block party if you have to work at Rody's? Well, I told Rody that I'd open up, and then Rita's gonna cover my shift. And I got Rody to donate 10 cases of soda pop to the party. That's great. Yeah. Going all out for the block party. Yeah, I'm an all out kind of guy. Ooh, just like last night, right out the door after the fireworks. Marty, I told you, someone has got to be there all night long. No night watchman, insurance, right? So, you sure you don't, it's not because you don't like my furniture? Absolutely. Listen, you know I'd have loved to have stayed there last night. Okay. I'll come clean. The reason that I went back to the community center is because I wanted to practice up on my basketball game because I don't want you to beat the pants off of me next time that we play. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, well, you know what? What? If we're playing for your pants, I want to get in some extra practice. Gets here, we're out of here. Okay. All right. Well, help yourself, Bridget. I don't know why I'm so thirsty. Must be the heat. How's summer school going? Don't ask. I've been busting my butt off at mom's office, which I'm not even appreciating. Between juggling, going to class, and and working full time and nights at the library, it's endless. Well, maybe you should just take a break. Yeah. Um. Go to the party. No, I have to study. I mean, I'm way behind on my on my reading. But no, don't worry, because good old mom offered to help me with summer school. So now there's no way I'll flunk out. Lucky me. And my Aunt Susanna's in town? And do I have any time to spend with her? No way. It's a total pain. But, you know, that's not the worst thing. Hey, Dylan. Know. Thanks for holding down the fort. I really appreciate it. You guys can take off now if you want. Excuse me, we're conversating here? Actually, we do need to be going, so uh, why don't you talk to Rita? She's a real good listener. Yeah, really. So many strangers tell me their problems, I should be a shrink. I don't need a shrink by the time I finish law school. You know how many all-nighters I've pulled, and I still flunk the class. I'm, my mom's never gonna let me hear the end of it, either. But it's not like... You really think we should leave it like that? I mean, she's so wired. Well, yeah, we need to go. I've got to help set up that block party. So. I have to think, should I go to a study group? Hey, Ken. Um... Listen, do you know what's up with Rachel? She's she's really hyper. Yeah, she's talking a blue streak in there. I think she needs you. Yeah, don't worry, I'll handle it. All right. Well, I hope she's okay. Yeah. Bye. So I think all the study groups in the world are not going to make me the kind of lawyer that they are. And you know what? I told my mom, give me a break. I mean, how many super lawyers can there be in one family? We're all lawyers here. My father's a lawyer. My mom's a lawyer. Everyone is, like, so successful in my family. Rachel. You know? Ben, what are you doing here? I need to talk to you. Wait, I was in the middle of a conversation. What about your hands? Why? Just do it, okay? Just... We both know what's going on here. Stop kidding ourselves and deal with it.